Okay, uh, well, uh, I have this little test board here for my um, uh, display that I pulled out of a piece of equipment. I only have one of these. Um, and I thought it was pretty cool, and I thought, kind of thought, well, it'd be nice to have more than one. Uh, maybe uh, put it in some kind of projects. Um, I did have several um, displays uh, when I was working at Hewlett Packard Opto Electronics Division. I did have some other 5x7 uh, displays. Um, and uh, they look like this. Um, they're eight. Uh, eight digit instead of only four digit and once again they're a parallel um, interface um, back in the day so I thought okay well let me uh, build up a test board for that so once again I used my little proto board here and uh, uh, this is going to uh, kind of sit on the board and uh, I have to go through all the pain of uh, doing all of this wiring um, so then I thought, okay, well, uh, these are nice. Um, I wonder, I wonder what you can get them. You know what they're going for on eBay. Um, you can actually buy these things still. Um, they're about forty dollars each. Um, quite amazing price for these things. So they they've always been expensive and remain remain expensive. So of course I poked around eBay. Probably shouldn't have, and um, I found these guys. <laughs> Uh, these are pretty cool. They're nice and narrow packages, uh, much smaller. They're eight digits as well. So they're basically comparable to this. I think even in uh, pin functionality and programming, I think they're pretty they're pretty similar. Um, these are made by Osram. Um, let me give you some part numbers. These uh, The little guy that I pulled out was a PD2437 made by Siemens. And the parts that I have from Hewlett Packard are an HDSP uh, 2111. And uh, these guys are a PDSP 1881. So, a uh, guy had these on eBay, lots of 10, made him an offer, four bucks each. He took it, free shipping, I think. So, 40 bucks, I got 10 of these. So, for the price of one new one, I got ten old ones. <laughs> um, so, okay, so now what do I do? Okay, well now I build another board. And, oh, geez, I got tired of building uh, building these boards. So, um, I figure it's time to lay out a PC board. PC boards are cheap and easy, so well, let's lay out a PC board. Um, probably a PC board to test each one of these um, so it has uh, three sockets and, and depending on which socket you use you can have a program to to drive these so um, uh, I think that's oops you can't see that um, so um, I think that's the next step is let's go ahead and uh, uh, go to Eagle and lay out a PC board and uh, uh, get this thing up and running <laughs> 